In this video I'm going to show you how you can choose a default video player on your Windows 10 PC. So to do this you need to go down to the bottom left hand corner and click on the Windows icon. Then you want to click on the little gear icon which is settings. And then from settings you want to click on apps. And then from apps you want to click on default apps. Then you'll be given a list of your default apps. If you scroll down a little bit, you should see the video player here. So for, for example, if you install um, a third party video player such as VCL Media Player or some other kind of player, you'll be given the option to choose from multiple different players. So all you have to do is click on them. You can then choose from a list. For example, the built-in player is called Films and TV, which it says is recommended for Windows 10. I personally don't like it that much. You can also choose such as Google Chrome, you have Google Chrome installed. And there's some other ones, there's, there's one from, um, there's a Power Director media player here and so on, Windows media player and so on. So just basically choose the default media player you want to open video files with. In my, in my case, I've already selected VCL media player. You can also, if you want to, um, if you scroll right down to the bottom, you can click here, choose default applications by file type. So if you ch click on that, and say for example you wanted to play uh, certain media files so you have ones which were mp4 and say ones which are mov or something like that you could choose a, a default um, application to play it so all, all this is a little bit complicated I wouldn't bother messing around with it myself but say for example you know you, you can see certain files here can be played with VCR media player and others can be played with a different player so you can you can just set like if you want to have two separate different players f for example so basically that's how you do it just remember click on default apps and choose your default video player that's how you do it thanks for watching